गुड मॉर्निंग यू गाइज इट्स अबाउट सिक्स फोर्टी थ्री राइट नाउ एंड आई हैव माई फर्स्ट क्लास इन अबाउट अ कपल ऑफ मिनट्स आई हैव अ लेक्चर स्टार्टिंग एट सेवन ओ क्लॉक इट्स ट्यूजडे एंड इट्स माई फर्स्ट डे बैक एट कॉलेज वर्चुअली सो आई एम सुपर एक्साइटेड बट आई एम ऑल्सो सुपर नर्वस टू सी हाउ दिस होल थिंग गोज But yeah, I thought I'll take y'all along my first week of classes and show y'all what my schedule would look like and document the whole thing so y'all could get a better idea. I also promise to document this whole process on my YouTube and take y'all along because I know some of y'all were really interested in watching these videos. So here I am. I'm gonna do it. I just made my way out of bed and I'm sitting on my chair right now. Um, I'm gonna quickly grab my laptop and some water and. hop into my first class cuz i think that's going to be starting in a couple of minutes so yeah let's do that for production in the sense that we only have to make one loaf right uh just so you know uh normally uh when i'm doing so i just hopped out of one of my classes and faced up my mom to gossip with my mom <laughs> Say hi. Hi. My mom is chilling in like at our farmhouse having the time of her life. Yeah. While I'm here um taking online classes. So, do you want to trade lives? I'm <laughs> back into my class in a bit and I'm also going to head out and I have to go grocery shop. So, I'm going to do that in a bit but for now I'm just going to talk to my mom and make some breakfast cuz I'm starting at hungry now so or use osmo tolerant which is a specific strain of yeast that um So I just finished making the loaf and I put it to proof for the final proofing just now and I finally have gotten to sit down. I have been up since 6 7 a.m. um and I haven't gotten to sit down till now and it's about 3 o'clock right now so it's definitely been a super tiring day and it was definitely really hard to multitask and film uh for YouTube as well as document stuff for college. 
um, as well as learn stuff. I just finished up making the loaf like you just saw and it's proofing. So in about 20 minutes or so, I'm going to go bake that and then do the finishing touches, take some pictures for my assignment. Um, and we're done with that. Uh, I had my first theory class from 1 to 3. Um, so I did end up taking that while I was baking for my baking skills class. So it was definitely a little bit of a task to uh, multitask and do both. I just had my laptop open on the side and I was listening to my professor speak uh, while I was baking for another class. So it definitely was really hectic. I'm so tired. Doing this whole online stuff was definitely such a weird experience. I think thus far it's been a really good day. Hopefully my oven doesn't give up on me and my baked products turn out okay fingers crossed but I just thought I'd check in and update y'all so the loaf is just done proofing and like you can see it's doubled up in size but yeah that's what it looks like I'm gonna give it another slight coat of egg wash and we're gonna put it in the oven Okay, so it's about 9.30 right now and I just got done working on the assignment package and I thought I'll show y'all. This is the assignment package that I had to make for the product that I made today for my production class. I know some of y'all are really curious about what my assignments look like so I thought I would show y'all. So basically we had to document all the steps in making the product um, and write a little explanation about it and attach uh, and attach pictures so that is basically what my assignment package looks like there's the end product that i made at 11 10 right now and i just finished working on my work plan um this is also a part of the assignment package that I have to submit for today's work. Uh, a work plan is basically a rough run through of everything that we're going to be doing along with some notes, some set time guidelines just for us to follow so we don't end up going over our time limit. hate making these. I find them very pointless but it's a part of my program so I'm going to make it. I just finished making it so I'm done. I am going to save this and upload both my assignment packages onto blackboard which is the software we use to um submit our assignments so i'm gonna do that and i'm basically done with work for tonight for school i will check in with y'all in the morning Man, do I look like an absolute mess today. But today is Wednesday and it's about 9 o'clock in the evening. I had no classes today so I didn't end up filming anything. But I did go grocery shopping today to buy a bunch of fresh produce to use for my classes for tomorrow and day after. So that's all I did the whole day. I just took a test for my theory class. So for my theory class, we had a test on breads. It was a review test so we did breads extensively in semester one so it was just a review of how much we remember from semester one there wasn't any content to go and learn from it was basically all based on what i can remember from semester one so i couldn't even go over anything i just finished taking my test um i don't know if you can see but i got a 95 i got one answer wrong and it was so annoying uh this test has multiple attempts so you can attempt to take the test twice 
um so i can take it again and get a hundred uh but i think i'm not going to because it was just one answer that i got wrong so i don't think it's worth going over the whole thing again so i'm gonna leave it it's a 96 i'm happy with it so i'm just gonna let it be because it was just one point that i got wrong i'm just gonna have a pretty chill night for tonight i'm staying in i'm gonna get some more college work done get some prep done for tomorrow because tomorrow is a fun day tomorrow i'm gonna be baking again baking skills class tomorrow and day after so i think i'm just gonna stay in prep for those classes and um yeah i just want to come in and give y'all a quick update i'll see y'all tomorrow when we're actually gonna bake i'm pretty excited for tomorrow so yeah i will see you guys tomorrow we'll start to get some stuff going for ex yesterday you know i forgot to put potato on the list so that's why i'm like uh oh you know hopefully you guys get all the ingredients cover and continue the bulk fermentation. You will fold one So I'm gonna be pickling some cucumbers for a sandwich for I think week six, but we had to make it today. So I currently have them in an ice bath and they have to sit there for an hour. So I have that going on. I'm also boiling up some baby potatoes for the potato salad. I was making the potato for the salad. I realized I was kind of hungry and I wanted an evening snack. So I'm making roasted baby potatoes for me to eat on the side. So this is just some baby potatoes cut in half with some spices. This chili powder, olive oil, salt, um, Italian seasoning, garlic powder, ginger powder, um, and a little bit of turmeric. So that's what I have there. I'm just gonna lay it out on this baking sheet and I'm gonna bake it in the oven for about, I'd say 30 minutes at 180, 200 degrees Celsius. So it's been around 30, 40 minutes now and the potatoes are nice and golden and crispy. So I'm gonna take them out and have a quick snack and then get back to making the croissant dough. So I'll be right back. <laughs> Hi 
<laughs> no, well, that's not what everyone asks you. Everyone, like for shoes because they know like what shoes they get big. That's what everyone asks you for. So this is the next morning. It's Friday and it's about 12.30 right now and I'm just getting started for the day. I just got my baguettes out of the fridge. They proved overnight and now they're ready to be baked. I just preheated my oven and I'm gonna go in and score the baguettes and then we're gonna bake them, so yeah. <laughs> De l'homme auquel ça appartient Quand il me prend dans ses bras Il me parle tout bas Je vois la vie en rose Il me dit des mots d'amour Des mots de tous les jours Et ça me fait quelque chose Took a little break to have lunch. I'm eating Rajma Chawal that we made last night for dinner. But yeah, just plated up some food, sitting on my roof, enjoying the view. I'm gonna eat this and then get back to baking. <laughs> Give the cameraman some fucking time. Ready for it? Hold up. Go for it. How do you like the salad? You need to do like a master chef reaction. You know how they're all like, pre like pretending not to like it, and okay. then.
is this? It's a Robin. <laughs> oh, it's great. It's so good. Oh, that's nice. And that's so warm. I like it. So I was just sitting here and editing the video that you're currently watching and I realized I didn't film an outro, it's a couple of days later, today is Monday of the next week and I just got done editing so I thought I would upload the video but then realized that I don't have an outro for y'all so I thought I'll come in, give y'all a quick recap of the week. I had tons of fun, it was so nice being back in the kitchen and baking, like you can see my face in that entire video, I was just so happy. Um, and I feel like it just released all the serotonin that I needed. That was basically what my week looked like at culinary school. For those of you who don't know, I study baking and pastry arts management at George Brown in Toronto. So I'm a pastry student in the making. I just started my third semester and it's online. So I thought it would be fun to document this. If you're new on this channel, subscribe so you can watch the rest of the videos and also follow me on this journey of doing culinary school online because this hasn't really been done before and i feel like it would be really cool if you subscribe and join the fam and help us grow but like i say in every video don't forget to like this video comment anything that you thought about this video or even future video ideas leave them down below i'd love to hear them also follow me on instagram that is my instagram feed it's kind of cute pretty fun pretty fresh so you should go follow me on instagram i tend to upload a lot more on instagram always putting up really artsy stories or at least i try to make them artsy See, that's it for this video. I really, really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one.